What's up everyone, my name is Alex Costa and we like to talk about fashion here and how to use style to show your personality, to look good so that you can feel your best. But the thing is, what about when that awesome outfit that you put together for your hot date comes off? You know what I mean, right? Things go well, you take your date home, and now you wanna make sure you look and feel good, right? Well, I want you to be 100% confident when that time comes. So today, we are going over how to look amazing even when you're butt naked. Let's get this first one out of the way. Being fit, looking healthy, that will obviously play a huge role in your confidence levels when you take your clothes off. This is what will make the biggest visual difference, right? So if you're really serious about looking your best, and I'm assuming that you are, then start exercising. You don't have to hit the gym hard every single day to look fit. You can go for jogs every day or every other day. You can ride a bicycle or even just do push-ups and sit-ups every day at home and that will help you look your best. As long as you're eating a healthy diet, of course. That's not filled with, you know, fast food, which is horrible for you. Soda, ice cream, candy, chocolate, you know, all the bad stuff that for some reason just tastes so damn good. Why is that, by the way? The unhealthy stuff that's bad for you tastes amazing. Anyway, as long as you don't eat that really tasty but really bad stuff and eat healthy foods instead, you will look great. But the thing is, if all your muscles, right, all your gains, your abs, if they're all hidden behind a forest of wild hair, then it will all be for nothing. No one will be able to see those gains. So for that reason, as well as many others, if you want to look good naked, you have to manscape. If you're a hairy guy, you should definitely trim down your body hair. I'm talking about chest, abs, arms, legs, and yes, the private areas as well, you know, because if it just looks unkept, if it's not tidy, it's gonna make you look like you don't take good care of yourself, and we don't want that. Today's sponsor, Manscaped, has everything you need to keep your package looking great. You definitely need to check out the new Lawnmower 4.0 from Manscaped. So their products are designed to take care of the most precious and sensitive areas of our bodies, and their newest release, the Lawnmower 4.0, is next level. All right, you can see that they've made major upgrades from the 3.0 version. Look at the design of this trimmer. I mean, it's perfect for a tight grip in the shower where you're probably gonna use it most because yes, it's waterproof, so you can trim dry or in the shower and then just clean it right after by running it underwater so that you don't make a mess in your bathroom, which by the way is the worst part of trimming, right? The mess after. Now, the best part about the Lawnmower 4.0 is the skin safe replaceable blade. Now, what that is is the blade is made to help prevent nicks, snags, and tugs in our sensitive areas. Now, I don't know if you've ever experienced a nick or a cut in that area, but let me tell you, it is not fun. It actually makes it look really bad too. Like if anyone sees that and they're like, so why, why, do you, why do you have a cut down there? That's an awkward question that you do not want to answer. It comes with two trim guards, which means you can pick the length based on your personal preference or your partner's preference. It also has an LED spotlight so that when you're exploring areas that are hard to see and reach, you're not gonna miss a thing. And they also have the new Manscaped Ultra Smooth Package, which is the ultimate kit for shaving down there. It has an exfoliant to prep the area, the crop gel to give you a smooth glide, and a great razor that's made for that area. It's a lot smaller, it's easier to handle in the hard to reach areas, and it's really well lubricated so that it gives you a smooth shave. Guys, I'll be leaving a link to manscapes.com in the description below. I truly believe that every guy needs to be neat when it comes to manscaping, right? So check them out in the link below so that you can look your best when it matters. So the question is, now that you have all the right tools, what do you actually do with it? Well, I'm hairier than the average guy. Thanks, Dad, for the hairy jeans, by the way. So I trim my arms to about a three millimeter. I do the same with my legs from my ankles all the way up. I trim my armpits so they're not growing wild. And same with my abs, you know, and I also shave my chest. That's just a personal preference. I like the look, but you can do whatever you feel comfortable with. And when it comes to your private areas, you can trim or shave. I will say shaving might make it itchy and uncomfortable once it starts growing again. Some people don't care, it doesn't bother them. Some people, you know, might not be okay with that. But I would say test both, see what works for you. Now guys, one of the biggest missed opportunities by men all over the world, right, but especially in colder regions, 
is being too pale and forgetting to get a tan once in a while. Guys, why do you think every bodybuilder, I mean every single bodybuilder, they all get a tan before a competition? Because it makes them look ripped. It gives them that extra definition that you're not gonna be able to get without the tan. So yeah, if you know you have a hot date coming up, maybe get some sun, you know, get some color on your skin. Or if you don't wanna do that because of the harmful rays, which I completely understand by the way, can be very unhealthy, then it's totally okay for a guy to get a spray tan or just a self tanner at home. Honestly, I am a true believer that a guy can definitely do that. I know there's a stigma against it, I don't agree with it because I definitely think that by you using self tanner, getting a spray tan, you're gonna look awesome, dude. You're gonna look amazing. Your abs are gonna pop, the chest definition is gonna come out. I mean, everything, the definition of your muscles will go to the next level. That is why bodybuilders do it. So I highly recommend. And speaking of having very defined abs, make sure that you're not eating foods that are gonna get you bloated before your date. <laughs> you know, there's a lot of foods that will actually make you bloated and then all your hard work, your abs are gonna be just not there. And let me give you some of those foods so that you know what to avoid. Definitely stay away from beans, from lentils, from carbonated drinks, definitely a big bloater there. Wheat, dairy, beers, those will all make you bloat. For me, if I have dairy or beers, man, my abs, they're gone. It's just one big ab and that is it. <laughs> So I, I try my best to stay away from those if I'm going to the beach, if I'm gonna do like a photo shoot or anything like that. Definitely none of that crap is going into my system. And when you take your clothes off, right, what are people gonna see? Well, your skin, definitely, first of all. So make sure that you're hydrating your skin. How are you gonna do that? Well, two ways. First, you have to drink water. For a thousand reasons, but for today's video, the reason is to hydrate your skin, to make sure that it has its elasticity, to make sure that it looks good, smooth, shiny. Right, you need that. So drink a lot of water, guys. Drinking water is, it's life changing. It's going to do, it's gonna give you so many benefits, trust me. But like I said, for today's video, your skin. It's gonna make your skin look great. Not just your skin here on your face, but also all over your body. So start drinking more water. If you're failing to do that, make sure that you set a reminder to drink more water. Moisturize your body, right? You should definitely use some body lotion whenever you can because this stuff, first of all, it feels amazing. It feels really good, but also it's going to hydrate and moisturize your skin. It's gonna make you look so much better. There's nothing worse than taking your clothes off and then your elbows, especially your knees, they look really dry, they look rough. It's just not a good look. And this is so easy. It looks good. It probably smells good. I know this one that I just used smells really good. And you know, your partner is definitely gonna appreciate it. I would recommend using body lotion once a day. It can be after you shower, or it can be at night before you go to bed, which by the way, feels really good as well. Guys, make sure to check out Manscaped in the description below so that you can look your best when it matters. They have amazing tools to make sure that you're Manscaped properly. And if you haven't checked out my new YouTube channel yet, definitely check it out. I've been posting there a lot. It's my new YouTube Shorts channel where I give you short, quick tips and videos. And I also post on Instagram and TikTok pretty much every single day. So if you wanna keep up with me, make sure to follow me there. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you again very, very soon. Peace.